Cause I own So I got to get my hustle on I own Yo, what's good Creep Squad fam? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another review video yes this is a review video because i kind of gave this one a once over you know what i'm saying um my man church here apparently is evolving my man here got some plans he's talking about a new house uh a quote big ass garage and content so uh let's go ahead and take a deep dive into this and see what my man be talking about together you know what i'm saying so without further ado y'all like to hit hit Don't look good enough for YouTube yet. <laughs> My man trying to look all YouTube fancy and everything, bruh. All right, let's cut to the chase. Over the next six months, you're going to see my YouTube channel change. It doesn't necessarily mean that I'm going to stop everything I'm doing now. Uh, it don't necessarily mean I'm going to stop finding creatures. Oh, thank God. <laughs> cause I, cause man, cause I, I love those reaction videos that I was making, bruh. I don't, I, and I want to keep making those kind of reaction videos. You know what I mean? So let's go on the internet. And it definitely doesn't mean that I'm gonna stop doing music because that will. <sighs> Thank God. Never happen. Now, don't get me wrong. The format that I have now is comfortable. I like it. You know, I like sitting in here and making mm -hmm. videos and shit like that. Um, but dude, I like how he's got that that '57 Chevy. Front end right there, all all lit up. You know what I mean, bruh, dude. I like that, man. Dude, I give anything to have one of those, man. Cause like I said, I'm a car guy myself. I love classic cars. You know, cars from like the 40s, like the 30s, 40s, 50s, and the 60s. You know what I mean? I, I yeah, I, I like I said, man. I love hot rods. I love low riders. I love muscle cars. I would love to have a 57 Chevy. You know, LED light. You know what I'm saying, like that, bruh. Bruh, that shit is lit, dude. That shit is fire. I gotta be outside. No, I'm not saying I don't go outside. I'm not, I, don't, I don't, like, box up my windows like, I must stay in the house. And I'm not... <laughs> you know what? Him, speaking of him being outside, you know what videos I, I really enjoy watching that I wish he would still make are those, um, those Harley ride-along videos that he used to do. Remember those? Where he, he would put on the uh, helmet cam and you would just see him take a ride, you know, just around the area, you know what I mean? And you would, you would just, you know, look at, check out the uh, the uh, scenery and everything, you know what I mean? Just, man, I, I, I miss I miss those videos, man. Let's go. I'm saying it's bad if you're a content creator that does have one specific spot. Right. I mean, I, I love this spot, mm -hmm. but there's more things to my life that I want people to see. There's more things to my life in the past three years that... I just haven't filmed. For instance, mm. when me and my buddies squad up and go out riding Harleys. Or yes, yes, I miss those videos. <laughs> we need more of those Harley ride-along videos, my guy. When me and my buddies load up some of my antique cars for music videos and stuff and go to places like Rod Run. Or when me and Beth... Oh, if he did a Rod Run video? Yo, best believe I'm going to be all over that, man. Now, now you speaking my language, my guy. When you talk... When you talk about these cars, man, that's when I'd be like, go on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's go. Load up the Jeep and we go fishing all day. Things of that nature. And mostly the reason why I haven't filmed any of that kind of stuff is really because mostly I'm just enjoying the moment. And when mm. I'm not out enjoying the moment, I'm working my ass off. Yeah. Which is why I have so many music videos, so many albums. Uh, you know, as, as some of you guys know, my primary job is being a musician, not a right. YouTuber. Right. And with the projects that I have lined up, such as People's Champ and the other three albums that I have lined up, I'm at a point in my career. Yo, so we got People's Champ, Pe People's Champ, if I can say that correctly. Um, <clears throat> and then he's got three more albums lined up. Woo! Woo! Talk about being busy, man. I mean, yo, this man right here, he is working ethics personified man straight up let's go here where how many albums i have is about to outnumber how old i am and that's not just shit i've thrown out there and it's done nothing i mean you gotta think the, all these albums are billboard charting albums they're all successful and mm -hmm. it's not that i'm getting tired of doing music i mean i've never even had writer's block so if you're a diehard listener of me you have nothing to worry about trust me will the music 
<laughs> that's a relief. I mean, I'm like him though. I, I have suffered from writer's block. You know what I mean? But I, I'm always, I'm, I'm always been that kind of dude. Like you know, hey, it, it'll come to me when the time is right. You know what I mean? The kind of song I want to put out there, the kind of music I want to put out there, it'll come to me when the time is right. You know what I mean? And when that time hits, and it's like, okay, stop what you're doing, hit the pad, write down everything you want to say. You know what I mean? Make sure you got you know your verses perfected and everything. You know you got everything straight. All right, cool. Let's go record. <laughs> but anyway, slow down a little, yes. But when you get the projects, it will be a whole different. Like yo, what the fuck? Twenty five fucking songs. Well, holy shit. Not only that, I want to do other things like focus on my record label a little bit more. You know, yeah. build it up. Also, I want to add to my roster. Which it which should be a priority. I mean, I mean, because now he has ch uh, Chase on his Chase Matthews, excuse me, on his uh, on his label. So yeah, that that should be a priority. Through Holler Boy Records, you know, I want to I want to find maybe two or three more people that you know we could build up and change their life as well. Anyways, moving on. Dude, that would be dope, man. Let's go. On recently, I have bought another big ass piece of property. And I'm currently having my retirement home built exactly how I want it built. Everything I could ever want. I'm putting it right here on this big ass piece of property. One thing I'm having built on this. Dude, I can't wait to see that that new spot, man. I bet it's going to be gorgeous, man. Let's go. Property is a 60 by 200 shop. And that's going to be for myself, my buddies, and my fucking bad car addiction. It's going to be... Ooh, he's building himself his own shop for his rides. Let's go. Like fucking NTB times 10, except for with really loud rock music and a bunch of ideas we shouldn't have. It's going to have storage for my cars. It's going to have lifts. It's going to have, uh, you know, a, a bunk bed area to where if other YouTubers want to come spend the night and do something or make a video... They'll have a spot for them. It's going to have one big-ass conference room for podcast. Downstairs, it's going to have one big-ass room for gaming. Uh, Dude, that's going to be lit, man. I can't wait to see that. That's going to be lit. Let's go. Not only that, I'm going to be getting all my watercraft license together because I've been illegally doing all that shit for my whole life. As some of you know oh, by shit. watching my YouTube channel, you know that I'm a river rat junkie, motherfucker. But one of the things I like doing... Yeah, I remember he used to do um, jet ski videos too, man. Yeah, and, th and those look like a lot of blasts. You know what I mean? Like, shh, th th those look like they, they, they were just a whole lot of fun. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I miss seeing him do like the outdoorsy stuff, man. I, I can't wait. I can't wait to see that. I can't wait to see um, this new this new spot. That he's got his retirement spot that he's got uh, being built right now, man. No, let's go. And is fishing and riding jet skis. You know, I want to be able to make a YouTube video where we fucking jet ski to an island for the night and build a shelter out of whatever's there. Dude, hell yeah. Those will be some badass adventure vlogs. You know what I'm saying? Let's go, church. Stay there for a couple days, fish. And vlog the whole thing. That would be fucking cool. Hell I don't yeah. Just locally, like I want to do shit like pack up my shit and go to a fucking Lake Tahoe. But hell that's yeah, my cars. So if anyone knows me the slightest bit, you know I have a muscle car problem. I've had. Uh, I, I I do too. Only thing is, I can't do anything about it though, which sucks. Bro, I don't know. I have had so many vehicles. New Corvettes, old Corvettes, mm. new Mustangs, old Mustangs, Shelby Cobras. Hell, I've had Shelby Cobras that there's only like 32 of them in the entire world. Lamborghinis, Camaros, anything from foreign cars to ratchet $1,500 S10s with the leaf springs heated up so it's lower. Oh, he did it old school, man. That is old school, heating up the springs to lower your rides. It's not really the right way the best way to lower your cars especially now when there's lowering kits available especially like, like belt tech for example belt tech is probably like one of the best if not the absolute best um companies out there that specialize in all that you know suspension kits whether it's lowering vehicles or raising vehicles you know what i'm saying but man 
I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm jealous of his car clip. He's talking about Mustang, he's talking about Camaros, man. Yo, yo, bruh. That's right. One of these days, I'm gonna build my fleet. You'll see. It's gonna be nice. Lord, that's a lot. Why I've never done car reviews, I have no idea. Now, look, I'll be real. Yo, straight up, man, with all these cars you have, man, I'm surprised you haven't done any car reviews, man. I would love to watch those, too. Like I said, me being a gearhead, too, you know what I'm saying? I would love to watch some car videos. With you, I'm not too much on the mechanics. I don't fucking like working on stuff. You can ask any of my friends. But, you can also... Truth be told, I don't either, but it's nice to have the knowledge, though. You know what I mean? So that way, if anything goes wrong with your car, you know how to fix it. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to worry about taking it to a mechanic or... Anyone else? Nah, it's like, oh, oh, it's this. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, you know, take care of it, or whatever. Like, um, and and thank God now that there's um, there's actually mechanics on YouTube that'll teach you how to do some stuff. Like, uh, if it weren't for YouTube, I wouldn't be able to uh, to learn how to do a, a coolant flush on my '91 uh, Chevy Silverado. You know what I'm saying? Um, I had to give that truck to my to my dad because you know I I just can't can't afford to have it right now. So yeah, I missed that truck, man. And yo, it's 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 a single cab too with the short bed, which is a very and it's a ninety one Silverado low rider. You know what I mean? I miss that truck, bro. So asking you, my friends, this: I'm a driving motherfucker. It's just something I love. I love being able to hop in any piece of machinery and being like, I know how to drive this. Yeah. I already know how it feels. Already know how it handles. Yep. I already know how fast I can go around yep. this curve without it breaking loose and sliding off the road. I already know how fast you can go in this vehicle without the fucking traction getting sketchy as hell. That's the side of cars that I'm infatuated with. So that's one of the things that I'm going to do. I am going to do car reviews, but <laughs> they're going to be the car reviews. Yes. Another thing I want to get into, I want to build a Fox body. Ooh. And I want to learn and get into circuit drifting. Yo, and instead of real talk, man, them Fox bodies be getting popular too now. You know what I mean? I've seen, I saw a gorgeous Fox body uh, out in Stockton. Uh, I was out there for like a job interview. And yeah, this dude was ro rolling rolling through with this gorgeous looking box body. It was like a two-tone color too. It was painted like a, like a dark teal metallic. You know what I'm saying? And then the bottom half was like was like a white, you know what I mean? And then he had like some some big chrome rims on it. It it was clean, man. Them, them fox bodies be looking nice. Why? I don't know. It looks fucking cool. Another thing, there's a school up in Michigan, Mercedes Benz Driving School mm -hmm. for defense driving. I want to take that course and become a professional defense driver. Okay. And last thing on my mind right now, this is the ratchet side of me. <laughs> this is the Pond Creek Road in me. I want to have YouTube videos where me and my friends. Man, I'm gonna go want to listen to um, Palm Creek Road after this, man. Talking about Palm Creek Road. Let's go. Ends by like fifteen hundred dollar S tens, and we show people out there how to remodel and make the motherfucker look badass for the lowest amount of money. Because that's what we used to do, and uh, frankly, that's what I still like to do. Give me some rattle cans, fuck it. Hell yeah. Know yeah. You know how many 16, 17 year old kids there are out there buying eighteen hundred dollar F one fifties? Mm. Me and Deardorff could show y'all some things that y'all motherfuckers think you'd be in a king ranch for like 200 bucks. All right. Really Yo, let's go, man. You could probably teach me a thing or two, man, because I'm still not that knowledgeable, you know what I mean? But I, I love to learn, you know what I mean? Like I said, because I like working on my own cars. I, I Especially with, with, with mechanics being what they are over here in California nowadays, you know what I'm saying? Doing like, like freaking haphazard work, you know what I mean? And they're charging you like up the ass for less than quality work you know what i mean yeah I, I i would love to learn learn some new things so i can you know be able to work on my own shit let's go realistically like 600 to 800 bucks but you get what i'm saying like i know a lot of y'all skins out there y'all y'all younger skins y'all be out there spray painting your shit outside me and deardorff can show you how to do it make that motherfucker look like you got it painted fucking and i'm not playing yo you could definitely teach me in that department as well it's all about prep, dude. There's a lot mm -hmm. of 16, 17 year old kids out there that drive around in clunkers that don't have the money to get the motherfucker wrapped for six thousand dollars or whatever the case may be. But sh damn, is that how much it costs to get your cars professionally wrapped? Six G's? Jeez, it 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 be costing somewhere uh, if 
Yeah, somewhere around that much just to get them painted. Over here, at least. Bruh. Shit, come Friday, boy, where's them cans at? Foggy? That's fast. Mm-hmm. Hello. Love you, too. Mm -hmm. What are you in there doing? Watching TV. Alright, we are watching? <laughs> She's like, uh, can I get back to you on that? <laughs> I'm just messing. Oh, Twister. Twister? Uh-uh, the old movie Twister? Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Alright, I love you. Is that, you. uh, do you need anything? Mm -hmm. You sure? Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you want to watch a movie or something? Let me know. Okay. Mm -hmm. I love you. I love you. Fat bottom girl, you make my <laughs> rockin' world go round. <laughs> love you, honey. I love you. Aww. Oh, she <laughs> made me tomato soup and grilled cheese. Yo! Oh, yeah, I just want to let y'all know, kind of. Yo, my man got the hookup for, for dinner, man. Let's go. What's going on and kind of my ideas and let y'all know that my YouTube videos may change a little bit. Some of you may like it, some of you might not. Mm. I've been working for a long time without stopping. I've been making music and content for a long time without stopping. Like I said, man, work ethic personified, bruh. I'm not saying I'm stopping, but I'm gonna finish getting this house built, get this garage built. And we're finna yeah, man, I can't wait to see that 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 new spot. You know what I mean with the shop, the game room, and everything. Yo, I'm telling you, man, it's gonna be lit. It's gonna be lit. And we finna light it up, boy. Hell yeah! Catal. Holy shit! I haven't said catal in forever. The fuck? <laughs> uh -huh. Well, you know what they say about old habits, man. They die hard. I'm eating my tomato soup. Love you guys. Oh, that's fire. <laughs> Yo, right on, man. I like this. I like this kind of video, man. I like that my man. You know what I mean? He he's he he's got a plan. You know what I'm saying? And he's getting into to some new things. And uh, you know what I mean? He kind of wants to get back into some some familiar things, some things that he used to do. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I can't wait to see um if he's if he's gonna do more of the. Like I said, the, the Harley ride along vlog, you know what I mean? Where you, like I said, you, he's showing you all the sights and the sceneries and stuff. I would love to see that. And um, the the uh, rod run, the hot rod run, I would love to see that too. You know what I'm saying? Bruh. I, bruh. And then, yeah, and then again, going back to this new place, I can't wait to see that, man. It's going to be fire. It's going to be fire. My man is truly blessed, you know what I'm saying? And rightfully so because... Like I always say, man, dude worked his ass off, you know what I mean, and has earned every single thing that he has, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, he deserves to live that good life, you know what I mean? And God bless my man Church, you know what I mean? And so, yeah. Can't wait to see what my man, what my man has coming out. I can't wait for that new album, People's Champ, and I can't wait to hear those three new albums he was talking, he mentioned earlier too as well. So, yeah. All right, y'all. I'm excited, man. I can't wait to see what Church comes out with next. Let me know uh, how y'all feel in the comment section down below. You know what I mean? I look forward to checking out y'all's feedback, as I always do. Don't forget to mash that like button if you're feeling this uh, reaction slash review vidya. You know what I'm saying? And uh, don't forget to check out all the links down below. Don't forget to check out uh, the links for all of my fan bam. You know what I'm saying? The folks at Rock with section. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you're showing them some love as well. And let them know. Your boy, JG. Your boy, JJV. Again, my name all messed up now, man. What the hell? But anyway, let them know. Your boy, JJV, done sent you. I'm sure they, they would appreciate that. And, uh, yeah. Y'all know the deal, man. Till the next one. Y'all have a blessed one, all right? Creek Squad. Peace.